just the accusation, just the insinuation can ruin someone's life. Person eats you, you cock-sucking motherfucker. Sherlock Holmes, you cock-sucking motherfucker. You're going to sit there and you're going to try to spin some bullshit narrative of me being a fucking child molester? You sick fucks know exactly what you're doing. It's like you've done everything possible to call me every fucking name in the book. You've called me a, a misogynist, a racist. A, you literally, any, any negative name, any negative thing, any negative classification you have put me into and spun the narrative in order to make people hate me. Any one of these things that you've called me, alcoholic, schizophrenic, crazy, violent, dangerous, misogynist, racist, any number of felon, any number of these things, any number of these things you've done, you've said, any number of these things that you people, you have created a narrative of, can get someone banned for life from any number of organizations. Canceled culture, fired from jobs, kicked out of apartment complexes, doing everything they can. And the accusation, pedophile is one of those things. Even the insinuation of that without anything else can destroy someone's life. And you're going to sit there and fucking try to label me a goddamn pedophile. You're going to have punchy Sinichu sit there and fucking... Fucking sit there, call me a goddamn transgender. Tell tell me I should fucking transition. You sit there and tell me to transition. You start talking about Chris Chan. You throw out some fucking name, JoJo something or other, whatever. I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? You say, oh, she's a she's a thirty year old trans. What? What? So I'm trying to figure out what the fuck you're talking about because I'm I'm actually trying to fucking give you the benefit of the doubt, Bungie. Trying to give you the benefit of the doubt. No, you, you don't deserve the benefit of the doubt. Saying, court is looking for judges, a 16-year-old girl. I'm fine, heavy. No, I'm not, you cock-sucking fuck. You fucking bitch. Oh, Penchy, Penchy has the best of intentions. No, he doesn't. You are a fucking malignant goddamn narcissist, you motherfucking fucktard. It's free speech. There's nothing we can do. It's just, oh, it's just, it's just magically happens. It's just, uh, it's the consequences of the, 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 the. Or, or will it be Timmy's version of justice where he smiles and winks at a judge and the judge goes, oh my goodness, let me put my hand under my robe and play with myself. Ooh. No, it's just revenge against Nick because Nick said something we didn't like 15 years ago. <laughs> And then you're going to sit there and you're going to fucking imply that I'm a goddamn pedophile. I would fucking kill you where you stood if you were a fucking pedophile. Punch you, Sinichu. No, you're not. Making videos saying that I'm a danger to children and a danger to women? No, that's not helping. Oh, well, you don't have a girlfriend, so you must be a danger to women. No. How is that helping? How is telling people that I'm a danger to children and women a, 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 a helping me in any way, shape, or form? If you actually gave, if you actually cared about me, you'd be trying to help me find a girlfriend or a wife. And they're ready to fucking pound my ass because they're like, yeah, we got a criminal we're going to fuck up. And then when I'm broken and bloody on the floor, they're going, okay, now we'll ask some questions. And then they're like, oh, uh, oh, uh, it wasn't what we thought. Oh, oh hey, Nick, we're, we're sorry about beating you half to death. No harm, no foul, bye. And I'm like, wait, <coughs> you know, coughing up the blood. 
Wait, officer, can't you do something about these people spreading false rumors and lies and slander on my name? Oh, no, there's nothing we can do. It's free speech. It's free speech. Motherfucker. <laughs> That's why I'm lashing out on. Oh, my God, I would love. I would love to see my fucking face splattered all across the fucking news networks. CNN, MSNBC, Fox News, every fucking news channel. The Nick Bravo story. But you know what? You know what? It's not going to happen. <laughs> you know why? Because I'm not crazy. I'm not mentally ill. I'm not a schizophrenic. I'm not an alcoholic. I'm not a danger to women and children. You, I got my motherfucking band hammer on. I'm ready to fucking crack some skulls. So you just, you just say the right thing. Say the right thing, motherfucker. And that band hammer will be going to be coming down real fucking hard on you. Real fucking hard. Hard and fast. Because I have done with this shit. You're the predators and then you look at somebody like me. And simply because I have the unfortunate genetics to look like I do. You want to call me a monster because the goddamn sleeping sheeple, the NPCs, are sitting there and going, Yeah, ugly equals evil. It must be true. Hey, hey. And some kind of a woe punch you won an award. Do you want an award, Punchy? Tell me your name and address. I'll have a trophy engraved for you. I'll have a trophy engraved with your real name. And it'll say congratulations to so-and-so for being the biggest fucktard on the planet. I will hand deliver it to you. I will hand deliver it to you. I will look you in the eye and then I will goddamn beat you half to death with it. You goddamn stupid shit. Oh, Nick hurt my feelings. It's a death threat. Ah. And then you want to go after me like a fucking, what, what the fucking predators you are. And you hide. You hide behind the safety of your fucking screen. You goddamn little shits. Do you actually think someone like me who is sexually attracted to tall, muscular women wants to do something to a child. Are you stupid? You fucking stupid cock. You don't have a CWC Pokemon family. And I swear to God, punch you, Sinichu, if I ever found out you were Christian, I would beat the living shit out of you. I'm not even allowed to be a man. It's bad enough. My body doesn't produce testosterone. I have to give testosterone injections. I don't barely get enough anyway. I'm also emotionally mature. I have these fucking... The pain that I'm... It's like I was bullied in school and the bullying has never stopped. The bullying has never stopped. Somebody beating the shot of me. Teacher, help, help, help. Teacher's like, I don't see anything. Oh, but, you know, little Nick takes it, you know, just because, you know, slapping away somebody slaps the bully. The bully's like, oh, I've been hit. And the teacher's like, I saw that. Nick, you're a monster. And every time I try to climb out, you fuckers keep digging it deeper. You're punishing me for even making a video. You're punishing me for having a voice. You're punishing me for having a voice because you're like, how dare you use a public platform to share your opinion? Right? Because everybody has the right to free speech except Corky. He's a retard. If I'm actually a retard, where's the empathy? Or is it kill all retards? Well, if you're going to kill all retards, show up at my fucking door with a gun to my fucking head and pull the trigger so I can move on to the next life. 
but I goddamn fucking guarantee you, you show up at my door, put a gun between my eyes, motherfucker, it'll be the last thing you ever do. Sit there trying to fucking paint me as a goddamn pedophile. Every I, I sit there and I make these videos and I show how much pain I'm in. I show my sensitivity. I show my love. I show the full range of human emotion and it's so fucking abhorrent to you that you have to destroy me as a human being. You see that, uh, you see that authenticity. You see that sincerity. You see that genuineness. And you can't fucking stand it. I'm not even allowed to have a job. I'm not even allowed to live. I have the right to live. I have the right to exist. By just trying to fucking live a decent, good life. I could have had an incredible life, an amazing life. You know, I, I honestly thought that I would find my tribe, that I would find my people, that I would find people who loved me and cared about me. Well, you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you, Karl Marx. Fuck you, Sherlock Holmes. Fuck you, Fidel Castro. Fuck you, Punchy Sonichu. Fuck you, happy Jesus. Fuck every goddamn each and one of you. Fuck you. Is that it? Is I am a creator? It is I, as a creator, so full of love and truth and virtue and authenticity? Am I that much of a threat to your fucking power structure, you miserable fucking psychos? <laughs> 